classmates. There is no need to tarry. You have lost your wager. for one to just retire in the garden while brooding and also trying to just unpack everything that transpired in the arena while they are just doing their usual Friday wager tax presentation of which the entire housemates lost their wager tax presentation. But what I am just trying to comprehend is the fact that while Handy is at that, she is crying in the garden alone and her bum bum is also crying. Her face is dropping tears and her bum bum is just making a loud sound. Crying. And me, I am not trying to just complain concerning that because every other person does that, including I. But my own is that why the bumbo is just making that loud sound. It was just the way she was just nonchalant about it. Like, as in, your bumbo is just making a series of sound. And you are not just even reacting to that. When I first heard that sound though, I was like, I have to take cover. Hmm. It may seem as though this is a gunshot. But on a closer observation, I realized it was actually Handy's bumbo that was just making a loud sound. Yes, so Handy was crying in the garden after they just finished their Friday presentation tax and she also had her bath. Letter. Her twin when joined her and they both cried together. Aside that, did you know that Chiwe and Zion are yet to just reconcile? Onyeka, on the other hand, has been moving around in the house trying to also deposit one or two strategies and also try to jam one or two heads together. Series of things has been happening ever since Big Brother announced that the housemate has lost their first wager of this ongoing Big Brother Nigeria season 9, no lose guard. I am here to just unpack everything but before I do so, let me quickly say welcome back again to my most beautiful, fabulous, interesting, intriguing channel of mine, If you Star Wars. And here on my channel, my only singular obligation is to always entertain and update you guys with non judgment are not sentimental and on by yes analytical analysis of the ongoing people that I just season nine no lose guard wow this is your very first time on my channel you are welcome 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 just sit according to your height now look down below you will see a red icon smash on it and subscribe to my channel and also do endeavor to turn on the notification bell that is right beside the subscribe button and feel free to give this particular video a huge thumbs up as i carefully unpack all the happenstance that has happened from the very moment big brother announced that the entire housemate just moved to the arena for them to do their usual Friday wager tax presentation. Why they were just did that? The first people to just take the stage are the pair of Ndine. They did well, followed by the twins, speaking about Wani and Handy. But at the time, when they were on stage, I noticed that they were just losing their lines and every other person took time to perform. So is the pair of the double K, so is the one of the, what's their name again? Speaking about Doctor and Ben, the action Ben, the ones that are immune for this week. Okay, I think it's better. In fact, the 14 pairs performed. It is time for Big Brother to just analyze and according to Big Brother that it was supposed to be a collective wager tax, but they just choose to just go there. In individual way well at the end big brother told them that they have lost their friday wager tax and of course we all know the drill now once the wager tax is lost the next thing is hunger strike of course they immediately then just enter back into biggie's villa the head of the house have to just gather them for a brief meeting and also admonish them that in as much as this is the first time ever of just doing their friday wager tax that they have already learned their lesson also kelly has something to just say and head of the house was like they should not just have to just brood about it or even just think about it it don't happen be said it don't happen they should just all brace themselves for the hunger that is about to come everybody went their different way others went upstairs to just cry while others choose to just have their bath camera was moving around biggest house and then went to the garden you know, handy was just crying there she's crying and her bum bum is also making loud sound thank god it was not even a gun shot now later, Wani was looking for her twin and she located her in the garden and why she was crying you know? and Wani felt so bad when she just saw her twin sister crying and tried to just know why she is crying. According to Handy, Handy said that she is already missing her sister Wani and Wani has been spending ample of time with Sean who is already in a ship with Wani and the ship is shipping but I don't know if it's going to ship to the permanent site. According to Handy, that anytime she just wants to spend more time to talk to play with her twin sister, her twin sister will just be in the arms 
of Sean. Now, so she can begin to cry. And she also said that during the Wager tax presentation, that Mwani was just snapping at her. That when she wants to say something or do something, that the way Mwani would just snap at her, she would just be like, ah, what is my offense? What did I just do to my twin sister? The next thing you know, they started crying. It becomes a crying competition. In fact, it was just a crying galore. They cried though, and while Mwani was just busy consoling Handy, and they kept on crying and crying and crying at the point, Mwani just had to join her sister and they both started crying and crying and crying. Wani would just explain and explain and then she will not cry. Handy would just want to complain and complain and complain and she would just cry. Then Handy will now just cry, 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 cry. And Wani will just even apologize again. And both of them cry and hug each other and cry and hug each other. Why the crime was just ongoing, you know. Big brother and I shift the camera. See Onyeka speaking to Tofa according to Onyeka that Wani has been very angry. That Wani saw Sean standing close to Nelly and she's not even having it. According to Onyega, that Wani is angry because Wani is aware that Nelly likes Sean. And Sean is also aware that Nelly likes him. It was just the way Tofa was just listening and nodding away. Onyeka now moved away from Tofa, just moving around the house looking for how to just operate. Camera now located DJ Flo, who is approaching Chinwe. And we're just trying to settle whatever it is that transpired between Zion and Chinwe. And why DJ Flo is just trying to convince Chinwe that it is alright. Chinwe now was also saying that she is done and dusted that she's just going to withdraw emotionally because if she does not do so that whatsoever zion does will certainly affect her and once she is affected emotionally she is not going to just function well dj flo is trying to convince her that it is absolutely not that deep chima is not even having it she just kept on lamenting and lamenting i am touching no i don't want you um, I'm just yeah, operating yeah. emotionally check out no, so no, I will no. not have to go mad every time no. stuff like that happens was like ah, ah madam do you just want to write lamentation chapter four it ended in chapter three according to how jeremiah wrote it she kept on complaining you know even the one in twin came to just join her console her and tell her it's all right she was just so happy later when he went to meet zion zion was even uh, sitting down while when he was trying to just talk to zion she would approach them because she was just stylishly trying to know what one is telling zion and she now strategically dragged one out of uh, where zion Zion is so and when he was just only asking Zion have you eaten I hope you are fine now Chiwe and the one now went upstairs so there again upstairs she was just busy still complaining saying that she is done and dusted I was like okay let's say I just going to bed this night I know by the time that both of them just cuddle each other they are certainly going to kiss so well, I, it no happened, no. They did not go to look and they did not even sleep together. While I was waiting for them to just give me content, nothing absolutely happened. Then I tried to just retire to bed and last morning, music started already blasting. And while this particular music was playing, she was the very first person to just jump up from the bed and was already dancing. And most of the housemates were still on their bed. They are just nodding to the music. Of course, it is already morning and Biggie's music is already playing for them to just wake up and start up their day. And I forgot to also make mention that in the closet, most of the housemates were just there having their conversation. And one of the twin, because I am yet to just get their names, whether it is OZ or OZ, whatever. But the point is, one of them were just trying to just entertain them. And the person was now saying that he has noticed that Onyeka likes Ben. And they were now saying, whether Ben might just be married. And Onyeka admitted that yes, she likes Ben. And also, one of the pair of them, then they're speaking about Chine, also said that she has also noticed that indeed Onyeka is attracted to Ben that she is a woman and she knows when her fellow woman likes a man and why they were just saying that and they were not saying maybe Ben might just be married or he might have a serious relationship outside the house Ben just have to call one of his friends I think it was Mayor Frosch in his defense to just explain to them that he is not married and neither is he even in any serious relationship outside the house and according to them, that Mayor Frosch said that one of the things that he's going to do if they just make it in Biggie's house is to just ship Ben. And according to their conversation, they were just there saying the things that they have observed concerning the ship that they want to ship in the house and the ship that is about to sell and the one that they think if it ever sells, it is going to just 
cap size well back to this morning at the washing area of course i've seen onyeka washing and i've also seen the double case speaking about kelly ray and cassia they are already washing and people that are moving into the house playing music they're just tidying the house the kitchen areas the closet and everywhere nothing much is still happening and camera moving again to the closet this morning it was just the way zion and chi we met themselves on the way and the way they just passed each other i was like ah now wow see this particular poor <laughs> i can't wait to see the way they go just going to settle well zion approached one of the radicals and we're like ah, i never said this i know how to just make her happy on the other hand while Chim was just standing close to the rails also one of the radicals approached her and was asking her, she was like no i feel better this morning i am fine i'm not just going to allow anything to just torment me emotionally I was like, is that serious? Anyway, me, I know that tonight Saturday party is just going to settle everything. You see the chimo that I know. Once they are in the party hall, or should I just say the party room and the music is blasting. You see all these female housemates noticing that Zion and Chimo are not in good terms, especially Onyeka. They are going to approach Zion and Zion is going to just rock them. They are going to dance together. Guess what Chimo is going to do? Because Zion noticed that two of us are not in good terms, he has decided to just start dancing with all the female housemates so that that will get to me i know what he is doing it is either this is going to just cause them to settle or it's going to just extend their fight whatever it is i am here to just serve you guys now let's rewind it back again to the complaint of handy to money because handy was saying that money is spending ample of time with sean hence there is no time for her to just bond with her twin sister so it is okay for sure to spend time with money but when victoria complains that sean is spending much time with money instead of sean and victoria to just bed together on a good talk say victoria is hated on the ship of Wani and Sean. Well, this is all it's all about too, that has happened in Biggie Sazo ever since they just vacated the arena and moved into the Biggie's villa. If there's anything that, that happened that I did not say, please do let me know because I did not even mention the fact that there were people that also cooked dinner for other people to just eat and they are already shouting, you know, make we just they minimize the way we just they cook because it is hunger strike next week. So if there is anything that happened that I did not even tell you and you watched, please do tell me in the comment section. And if there is anything that I said that it is not okay with you because your faith is involved, also feel free to just counter or post and argue in the comment section But while you are at that, be safe. And until I come your way again with another sweetest update and entertaining cheese that has to do with the Big Brother Niger season 9, I am still your favorite entertainer with continuous entertaining entertainment signing out saying no lose god